But take. Or, yeah, there he is, there he is. Take your time, take your time. I think it's a little brown. Bring, lift up, lift up, lift up. There you go, nice. Oh, we popped off right there. First ever brown. Yeah. Woo, not big, but hey, we're doing something right. That's good. We will take it. We're in Milwaukee again, doing another little trip out here. Take your time, take your time with him. If he's gonna- Try to bring him around here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just take your time with him. Yeah, I think he's a little better than the other one. That's oh, for, yeah, sure. for sure. He feels way bigger. Yeah. I see leader, I don't see the fish yet. Here, come over me, come over me so you get away from the motor. Okay, you're good. I haven't seen, oh, there he is. He's just down deep. There he is. It's a nice, oh, it's, I think it's a female. Reel down, reel, reel, you gotta reel, you gotta reel, Kaysen. Oh, don't let slack, don't let slack ever like that. Now pull up, pull up, pull up towards me. Keep, keep pulling, keep pulling. There you go, nice. It's a, I think it's a buck. That's cool color, you see the yeah. colors on that thing? This one's white nut, this one's it's a, it's more, it's definitely better. Yeah. All right, Case. Nice brown right here. That is a nice brown, nice male. Yeah. Let's get the release. Beautiful fish. There he goes. There we go. All right, we are hooked up. Dude, there's tons of fish on this little, this area. Like, tons of fish. We might get another, we actually might get another bite here. That'd be crazy if we got the Yeah. I mean, it's, it's decent. It's not crazy though. He's got some good, dude, he's got some good head shapes. I know, I know. Yeah. Just watch, watch the other rods, because something might go off. All right, so what, remember what I, I told you? Yeah, scoop. Scoop. Yeah, it's not bad. It's, yeah, it's, yeah, it's not bad at all. Still not the Goliath we're looking for. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. S scoop. Nice, Kaysen, well done. Atta boy, good work. Sweet, that's number three, dude. Yes, it is. All right, well, that's number three. Another little brown. Yeah. <laughs> Doing pretty it's a good, good day so far, somehow. yeah. Yeah, not bad. We just found a bunch of fish in this area over here, so to yeah. get him right back. He's Good healthy, release. swim right off. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah. Number five. Dude, it's small. Where are all the big ones at? Would you say? Small. Yes. Yeah. It's small. You can literally just skate him in because he's so small. <laughs> this lure's been hot though today. Oh, look at. Okay, we're not even gonna That's need the net. Deep. We don't even need the net for this dude. We're just gonna both of them. It is the smallest one, and I think it's a coho, actually. Coho. Yeah, because it's got the fork tail. You see that? Oh yeah. It's got a nice little fork tail there. But he's all wrapped up, which is super annoying. No, no, no. It's okay. It's not terrible. I can tell you that much. I don't think, I think it might be like five pounds or six pounds or something like that. I don't think it's a dink though. Just by the head shakes it was doing, it felt like maybe it's like a... Oh yeah, it's not bad. Oh, it came off. That's okay. That's okay, I didn't really want to deal with them anyways. There you go. You don't have to, don't reel the entire time, remember? Remember, just you yank up, you pull up slowly, and then you reel down slowly. Pull up even higher, too. Oh, double, double, we're doubled. We're doubled. <laughs> oh, shit, this is gonna be a shit show. No, I don't think it's big, but. Here, fuck, actually, I'm gonna put this guy back for now. 
you good, you're good, you're good. Get the fuck out of here. Take your time, please. What do you say? Yeah, I know, I know. Real, real, real. Uh -huh. I don't know if that fish is still on. I think it is. I'm pretty sure it is. Is it? Is it? What? Okay, okay. Yeah, he's still there. I feel him. Okay, reel down. Reel down to me. Keep rolling, keep rolling, keep rolling. Alright, y'all. You're good, you're good. <laughs> we got a double. <laughs> take your time, take your time. With him. I'm pretty sure that fish is still on. It looks like it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's still on. No, we'll finish this one and then we'll... I'm, I'm pretty sure just from the way the board's moving. Yeah? All right, all right. Take your time then. If he fights, if he does any head shakes or anything, don't, don't reel at all. What does your line counter say? The line counter? 27, okay. Yeah, oh, well, that's a decent one, dude. Yeah, that, that one's all, that other one's on, too. No, it's not. No, it's, is it? I think. No, 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 no. I don't think so, dude. I think that fish just went on a little run. I'm pretty sure not. I'm pretty, that board, that line's far out. That was just that fish. So, we are, that fish is still on. All right, I got leader. Yeah, no, you're good. You're good. Let him do his thing. I'm with one more reel, and then you're gonna pull up on him. He's he's decent, dude. That's a decent fish. Yeah. No, Casey, you gotta. You gotta oh. Damn it! All right, we got another fish on. Your fish is fish salon. Yeah, he is. Definitely. You also gotta get the motor too. Actually, no, we're good right now. But just try to get that hook out as soon as fast as you can. Take your time. You're okay. Actually, get the get the boat. Get the boat. Turn us. Turn us. Turn us left. 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 It's okay. Take your time, dude. Take your time. The other way. The other way. The other way. There you go. Strain us out, strain us out. I'm pretty sure this fish is still here. Yeah, he's definitely still here. Oh yeah, this feels decent too. Oh yeah, this is actually a pretty good fish. He's got some weight on him. Can you turn us? Actually, you're good. You're good. Do you need help? No, I got one. Okay. We're good for right now. Um, do you want to turn the boat? Actually, try to straighten us a little bit. Straighten. Well, just because we're turning, we're still turning. We're gonna turn. He's right there. Take your time, take your time. It's okay. I got one off baby this fish. He's doing, he's actually, I'm pretty sure it's a good one. It also might be easier if you just unhook it, the hook, maybe. Yeah. In the water. Oh yeah, dude, this is a decent one. This is a nice. This is a nice big brown. This is a nice colored up brown. Yeah, yeah. Turn it the other way, like upside. Yeah, turn it. There you go, like that. Just like that. 
This is a nice one. Okay, remember? Okay, duck down, duck down, duck down, duck down. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'll tell you when you scoop down. Okay, one. Okay, you ready? You ready? Yeah, I kind of want to... No, 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 no. This is a nice one. Okay, you ready? Oh, no, no, no. I don't, he's not hooked well either. Okay, case, okay, case. Shit, 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 shit. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 stop, stop, stop. Not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet, no. Okay, 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 okay. Now. Yes, Kaysen, well done. Great net job, dude. Great net job, look at that beauty. That is a big boy. That's a nice fish. Give me some. Go. Good job, dude. We got our, what is this? It's like our eighth, I think. Eighth, maybe? Of the yeah. Day? Really nice, big German brown. Super cool. They come in and they come up close to his tail and go all the way across yeah. the body. This is a beautiful fish. Really Fiber beautiful. brown. Yeah. Like, you love to see it. Awesome. Good morning, everyone. And welcome back to Harlan Expo Exploration. I'm your host, Jack Brennan. And today we're exploring, yet again, Lake Michigan and Milwaukee. But today we're doing something a little different. Instead of fishing up shallow next to structure and stuff, we're gonna be fishing almost the middle of Milwaukee Harbor, the big, the big harbor. And what we'll be throwing today is we're gonna be throwing dipsy divers. And for you that don't know what a dipsy diver is, basically what it does is it drives down in the water and it brings their lures down deeper in the water column. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I've seen things about Lakers being caught in here recently, and I've also seen things about, uh, or I've also been marking a lot of fish on the bottom. So I'm trying to get my lures down deeper, so to try to get those fish more, you know, attracted um, to my lure, basically. So basically we're just gonna be trolling yet again, and we'll be out here all day. So hopefully we can get, uh, hopefully we can get on some fish, but basically that's that. And I'm excited because uh, tomorrow I'm leaving for New York, upstate New York, to go hunting for a week. Uh, I'll be making a video of that, hopefully, getting some on some a buck or maybe a doe or something, just try to get some meat in the freezer. But but yeah, so I hope you enjoy the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and keep exploring. Hooked up. It's been a while. It's been about two hours. We've been out here. Without a single bite, but we are finally hooked up on a dipsy diver. Literally just started trolling again. The wind started picking up, so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna start trolling again. See if the wind would help at all, but and <laughs> seems like it has so far. I don't think it's a huge fish. But we will see. This is my first time ever gonna be netting a fish on a dipsy diver with, in here on this uh, boat too. So honestly, I don't even know if he's still there. I'm hoping he's still there. Feels like a little more weight than normal. But we will see. There's a dipsy. Oh yeah, no, there's gotta be a fish there. All right, let's see. If I can do this. Oh yeah, nice one. Nice brown. Stay. No, no, no. Oh, come on, come on. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Might honestly have to hand line her in. Direction is good and all. So close, so close, so close. Okay, okay, okay. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, 
great, so can't take a time with this. There we go. Yeah, hook just popped out. That's a nice brown. That's a thick fish. All right, sweet. All right, guys. Well, we're back in Milwaukee again, and we're trolling. And it's been a while since we got our. Oh, wow. It's actually cool. I'll show you this in a second, but um, it's been a while. This is our first fish. We're gonna keep them. We got gilled pretty well, so we're gonna keep them. I'm pretty sure it's a big, big male. It might be a female. I'm not sure, but it's thick. Super thick fish. Super cool though. And he actually just spit up this which if you can't tell what this is that is actually a shad and it's not an ly because it actually has a black dot right above right by its gill plate so that's what they've been eating a lot of the there's tons of bait in here and all that bait's probably a bunch of shad and there might be some alewives mixed in there might be also some, some perch but a ton of it is just shad and this this fish just ate this morning too so it's pretty cool so yeah, let's keep uh, uh I'm not close back yet. Let's uh, let's keep fishing. So on the bottom here, so you got bottom right here. It's the main hard yellow, and then right above it, there's all these weird bumps. That pretty positive. That's uh, it's all bait. It's almost like these schools of shad all together. And there's gonna be fish just like this, sitting right behind it, coming in trying to eat some of that shad. Pretty crazy. Fish on! Fish on! It's not big. Same crankbait. Crank's been hot. Pretty hard recording. It's very different. Yeah, it's a nice little, cute little guy. I want to see if he just comes off now. Easier for me. There's, it's crazy, there's a drop off out here. And it drops from like 19 feet all the way down to 28 feet. And these fish just sit right on it. There we go, in the boat. We're hooked up yet again. About 10 minutes after the other fish. I don't think it's a, that big of a fish, but I'll take it. I've not missed fishing by myself and driving a boat while trying to reel in a fish by myself. Feels a little better than the last one. Still not great, but man, this lure is on fire today. This is the third fish from this lure. It's actually insane. Why aren't we trying? There's leader. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, definitely better. Nice. Probably gonna net this one. I still don't even know if. We're Alright guys, so we got fish three. Definitely better one than the last one. I believe it's it's a female. We're gonna keep her no matter what. Yeah, I feel her eggs in there. Pretty cool. So it came on the same square or same crankbait. It's been hot today. Super hot. <sighs> Just like that, we are off the water. Um we actually are ending the day a little early here. I wanted to get off the water literally at sunset, which is in three hours, but it was getting a little choppy out there, a little too choppy for me. I am in a small boat, 14 foot Alumacraft, which kind of sucks, but it is what it is. If I had another guy in the boat, I probably would have stayed out, uh, just to have that, you know, that counterweight front and back. Um, and also, we actually almost ran out of fuel. Um, dumb me, didn't put any more fuel in the in the tank before I left, but it's okay. I caught some fish, we did some good things. Actually, I wanna show you um, kind of what I've been catching the majority of my fish on. Um, right here, this is the Berkeley Flicker Shad. It is the spotted golden shad, 
It's actually a great color. This has caught about, I want to say 50% of the brown trout I've caught this year so far. So it's been doing really good. It's got a lot of battle scars already from just fighting fish, which is awesome. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna get on the way home. Uh, I'm gonna clean the fish. I think I'm gonna do a little catch, clean, and cook video for you. Probably do that at the end of this. So stay tuned and we'll be home shortly. All right guys, well, we're back in my kitchen here. And today I'm gonna show you how to cook and prepare some brown trout. You can also use this recipe to catch uh, for salmon as well. So basically our ingredients are brown trout. We got a stick of butter, probably won't use all of it. We got some broccoli for one of our sides. We got some garlic. We got some more rice. That would be also one of our other sides. Some brown sugar and some thyme. I like fresh thyme, but we don't got any right now, so this is what I'm using. So yeah, so basically what I'll do is I'm gonna wash off this broccoli and I'll cut it up into chunks and put it into, uh, put it on the, this pan here. And then I'll also make a paste for this, for this uh, fish here. All right guys, well, we got our fish laid out and our bro broccoli all cut and prepared. We got the rice cooking that always takes the longest, so you wanna set that first. So now what we're gonna do, um, we're gonna get our paste going. So basically what we're gonna do, we're gonna melt down some butter and we'll add some brown sugar right here into that butter and we'll mix it all up. And then we'll also take some garlic and mince it all up together and take some thyme as well and uh, mix it in there. So I'm gonna start that. I'll be back to you once I get that all finished and then we'll get the fish in the oven. take it I'm just gonna put a nice coating on top and stick her in the oven. Try to spread out some of that garlic if you can. Alright so now we got our fish with all the juice and stuff on it, good stuff. I put some 20 Katakshori seasoning on there on the broccoli. And now we're gonna stick her in the oven. The oven I preset to 400 degrees. Stick her in here. 15 minutes. Take the fish out of the oven now. Smells good, that's for sure. Yummy. Yeah. Butter sizzling. Broccoli's perfectly cooked. Fish looks perfectly cooked. Sweet, time to feast. Uh -huh. 